Wouldn't it be nice to have a tamper that takes a bit of the guesswork out of the tamping? That's exactly what this norm core aims to do and that's what we're going to talk about in today's video. Howdy, hello and welcome to my channel. I'm Tom from Tom's Coffee Corner and today I'd like to talk to you about this norm core tamper and why I bought it for my setup. So the main advantage that this tamper has is in its design. First of all, it sits right on the rim of your portafilter. That way when you press down on it, you're pressing very evenly. So that's advantage number one. And number two is it comes preloaded with a 25 pound spring in there. So that takes the guesswork out of the amount of pressure to press down with. It also comes with two other springs, I believe a, a 30 pound and a 20 pound. The reason I bought this tamper, however, is for something else. And that is because um, Normcourt realizes people want to get a tamper that fits directly to the basket. There's very little play there. And what that means is when I press down, I have very little extra powder here on the rim. With a conventional tamper like this one from Mota, it's also a good tamper. Can you hear all that play? It's got a lot of play and what that means is that there's a whole bunch of extra powder here on the rim and that is unfortunate because it gunks up your group head and making it eventually kind of leak down the sides and that is really a bit of a mess. So let's talk about the specifics of this tamper here, most important for me is the diameter. So I got my trusty calipers here. I have a La Spaziala machine. The La Spaziala is 53 millimeters. You can see this comes in at 53.3. So the baskets these come with are generally a little bit bigger than what they say. If it says 53, it's generally 53.3. And if it says it's 58, it's generally 58.4. So that is why I reached this norm core. So these come in three different versions that I've seen online. This is a 53.3 millimeter. They come in a 58.5 millimeter as well. And I believe they make one for DeLonghi being a 51.3. Don't quote me on that. Write into the comment section below if you bought this model for your DeLonghi. It also comes with this handy little cup. I didn't think I was gonna use the cup, but it does get a little bit of particles on there and just setting it in the cup each time actually keeps your counter space pretty clean. So that's nice. Let's talk about build quality for a second here. It feels really good in the hand, it's solid. It weighs even more than this Mota one does. The Mota weighs 311 grams. This one weighs 361 grams. It comes with a stainless steel base and a stainless steel spring inside. And the handle is aluminum. I'll unscrew it for you once. Here's the spring. Here's what the inside looks like. It's a nice, sturdy, ergonomic tamper. There is only one caveat that I would say about this tamper, and that is, as you see here, it's only got a certain amount of depth that it can squeeze down to. So what that means is, looks like that depth is around 10 millimeters plunging depth. So I have La Spaziale, as I mentioned, and these baskets are super deep because they're not very wide. They're 53 millimeters wide only. They have to make them pretty deep. And what that means is you have to fill this up to about this level in order for this tamper to work. The standard tamper, you can fit that all the way down in there as far as you want to go. So that's the advantage of a conventional tamper. The norm core you need to make sure that you have enough coffee in here. But you should anyway. So that's it. That's the Norm Core Tamper with the automatic level, with the automatic 25 pounds of pressure. 
and with a nice little cup. So I would recommend this. I do like using it and I will only use the conventional one to tap down a little further if I put too little coffee in there. Sometimes I want less coffee. All right, so thanks a lot for watching guys and we'll see you next time. Happy coffee drinking.